here's Vanessa from the Gingerbread Cottage and I have quite an exciting project today. I came across an old cookbook from my aunt which was reading in the um, even written in the old writing and this one here was made it, it's a they all war recipes recipes from the war and um, here she has a, a cake she makes with beans but and here I even found a a newspaper article from 1919 from Dr. Renner in Paris in December of 1919 so quite interesting it inspired me and I want to show you I'm going to do a series of recipes um, with um, uh, that cost very little and are delicious so the first thing I want to show you here I have some uh, ground cookies cakes I always keep my cookies and my cakes put them through the food processor dry them on a sheet and then when they're totally dry I make them into powdered almost like flour and my aunt taught me that you can use this instead of flour and you can also use it for cake bases um, you know for cheesecakes and things like that so today I made flour out of my cookies and my Christmas stolen that was left over and I'm going to show you how to make a gâteau today so we have here we're going to put in some butter we have about half a cup of butter and we have some sugar about half a cup of sugar and we are going to cream that briefly I don't want to bother you with the noise but just briefly to show you. so here is our creamed butter we add two eggs and now we're going to continue and I'm also going to add my um, cinnamon you can also use gingerbread spice whatever you want a little cinnamon is always nice and then we continue creaming it so I just pushed the sides down and loosened them because uh, my butter was very cold. So I'm going to continue and incorporate it. So this is nicely incorporated. Now I'm going to put in my flour, my crumbs and a teaspoon of baking powder and I'm going to briefly mix it. We don't want to beat it to death, just briefly mix it. And that's it. So here I have a prepared um, cake pan, flat one. It's going to be a gâteau. And it's buttered and floured. And now we're going to put our dough in here and keeping with the spirit of trying to make uh, inexpensive um, recipes and using what we have I look in my freezer and I found all kinds of fruit so I'm gonna just this here will bake out and will go to the to the to the uh, edges so here I have uh, some here I have some pears just going to frozen pears that's fine just put them on and I'm just gonna distribute what I have put it here and here and a few strawberries mm -hmm. and to give it a very nice crust on top I'm going to put some some uh, yellow sugar on top and then it goes in the oven at 350 or 325 in a convection oven and it comes out really easy because we uh, of course we um, lined the cake so this is amazing 
and I could use my leftover um, my leftover I'm just going to put it onto here and then I'm going to cut a slice and bring it off and see this is absolutely gorgeous beautiful slice of cake it's a flat cake it's like a, a gateau but here it is for you and wonderful way of using up your old cookie crumbs enjoy it's called a gateau enjoy and we'll see you next time